Uh, two years ago today, we lost our daughter Priscilla after um, emergency surgery for twin to twin transfusion um, for her and her sister Tabitha. Uh, we had only named Priscilla a week or so before, um, and her name is very special to us. It came from the book of Acts, where it talks about um, this woman Priscilla and her husband Aquila, who took aside this man Apollos, who was sharing the kingdom of God with anyone he could get his hands on. And they told him about Jesus and that Jesus had died um, and risen from the dead for our sins, that we could have a relationship with God. Um, and the gospel just spread like wildfire from them sharing with him. Um, and we wanted that for our daughter. We wanted her to be someone who understood the gospel of Jesus and could share it like that. Um, and so today, um, in her honor, I would like to share what she taught me. Um, in the moments um, after her death two years ago, um, just seeing her go from a very bouncing, constantly moving baby girl on her ultrasound to, to completely still will never leave me. Um, and in those moments, I think that I had never fully understood the love that God has for us that he would willingly give up his son for you and for me. Um, in losing a child, I, I think I better understood what it would be like to lose a son like that. Um, and to do it so willingly is an amazing testament of God's love for us. Um, so as much as I felt like Priscilla pulled me aside and said there's so much more to this story, I... I hope that today, if you have not um, thought about how much God loves you and that through Jesus Christ we ha can have a relationship with God, um, I hope that you will think about that today. Um, and if you do have a relationship with Jesus and you live in the joy of knowing that salvation, I ask that today in Tabitha's honor that you would share um, the gospel of Jesus Christ with someone that you know. Thank you.